I wasn't exactly going after her and I had no idea at the time, this is completely me being honest, I had no idea of Francis's feelings towards Sophia being so strong. Last night was the first time watching that episode that I saw their scenes together. Um, I hadn't actually seen any of that, so that was the first time me seeing all of that. And had I seen that, you know, I never, I never would have done that. Um, and I felt really bad. Um, Boule is my boy and I would never do anything to hurt him. Um, but Sophia is a great girl as well. Um, so yeah, I had no idea. I really didn't. Not really, like, it was one of those weird ones. I guess occasionally he would, whenever I would say to him, I'd be like, Francis, do you like Sphere? Like I would always, as me, like with, with a really close friend of mine, I would always be honest and I would just say, yeah, I do. Um, so he wouldn't be as bad as to say no, but he would just act quite, he would just act quite sketchy. Um, and maybe, you know, I should have caught onto that more. Um, but, you know, at the time I just, you know, I didn't really think. I just wish that, in that situation, I just wish that he had just been honest and said, you know, I do really like her and then, you know, I, I would have, I wouldn't have gone, you know, I would have backed off. Again though, also, with that night as well, obviously we were all together drinking quite a lot. Um, so, you know, everyone was a little bit drunk and, you know, these things happen. Um, Watching back last night's episode, I feel really bad um, because a lot of the stuff that happened, as I said earlier, I didn't see. I didn't see any of it. So I didn't see Francis with the book or them going to the art exhibition. Um, I didn't see their conversation at the, at the dinner party when Francis walked off. Um, so I didn't actually see any of that. Um, so having watched back last night's episode, I do feel really bad. I'm really sorry. My favorite thing about Boule, um, so many. Um, I'd say his bushy beard is my favorite thing. I love it. Again, this is annoying because at the time I had no idea and this, is, this happened quite a while ago. So now this is the first time I've seen it and now I'm I'm really bumming out because I, I did invest feelings in, into Sphere and I took on a few dates afterwards. Um, because, you know, for me it wasn't just a one night stand, you know, I did like Sphere. And um, so, yeah, I do take on a few more dates. Um, so, sorry. I can't choose between the two of them. It's not fair. Um, Again, I would live with both of them. A three-man house all the way. Three lost boys, forever. My favorite memory would have to be the time we were living together over the summer in our last house, which was like two months. Um, that was a very, very cool time. And we had a lot of, a lot of fun over that period. It was really fun. Um, <clears throat> I don't actually have one now, I lost it. Um, I've had that cross earring since I was about 13 um, and I've always had it. It was, uh, it was Pat Cash, the tennis player who inspired me and I feel lost without it. Uh, yeah, that is actually true, I couldn't get into the house. That's completely true. I actually did even try climbing up the wall um, and I climbed through someone else's window and then I realised so I had to climb back down. So that is actually true, I can go into the house. Well no, I mean no, that was the whole thing as well because I know, um, you know, as, as I am, Sophia and myself are very like, we like to keep things to ourselves. Um, and, you know, we would have liked to have kept that to ourselves and it was, it was annoying how, you know, it's impossible without you know doing something in Chelsea and not everyone finding out about it. And I was annoyed, you know, that Spencer, you know, announced it at the dinner table that night um, because I would have preferred that to, to being kept between us. You know, obviously I would have told Jamie and Francis um, because you know they're my boys. But um, yeah, it's annoying that. Um, so I guess yeah like that's the thing in Chelsea, you know, everyone talks about things so much. So it's very hard to keep things to yourself. Definitely not. 
Me and Francis are all good. Um, even at the time, we were, we, we, me and Francis haven't had one argument and nothing will tear us apart. He would be, uh, he'd be a meerkat. Definitely a meerkat.